Hey guys, back with another YouTube video. I just hit 400 subscribers last night. Thank you all for subbing to my channel. And I still remember when I only had 10 subs and now I've got 400. I got a bunch of people to thank. I got to thank my friend JJ for starters. And I got to thank my friend Billy the King, I think his name is. He always comments on my YouTube videos and I love his comments. And to all my buddies who helped support my channel, like my buddy John Bulligan, he and I have done deals here and there. So today I thought it would take, as a 400 video, I'd go way back. Back before I was even making knives, I normally just did it as a hobby. Like normally when, when I said the best material to start out with is a metal file to make your first knife out of. It's a very doable material. It's a very hard seal. It will break on you if you're not careful. But then I thought, of what if I take it way back, back before I had my belt sander, my drill press. All I had was a simple angle grinder that you can pick up at Harbor Freight for 20 bucks. And that's what I'm doing for my two, for my 400th video, is making a knife so simple to make that anybody can do it. It's something you can easily start out with. As y'all may remember in a previous video, I got this machete from my friend Mike. Now this is, this is no high dollar machete, this is a China machete. You can get these at Walmart for dirt cheap, or you can just go to a flea market and pay even cheaper for them. And basically what I used to do is, I, I still do this actually, is what I take, I go to flea markets and buy dirt cheap machetes and I chop them up. I can take this, chop it in half, make two knives, or take it and chop it up and make it into three knives. So I figured since this is what I did for my very first videos is, no, I'm afraid that. This is what I started out as just taking machetes, chopping them in half and making small knives out of them. Because a machete is an easy material that anybody can get a hold of. And if you chop it in half, then you got this material to use to make another knife. And then you've got this material. So if you screw this up, you got another piece you can work with. And all you have to do is use a simple angle grinder with a cutting disc and a sanding disc. <clears throat> so first thing I'll do is take the handle off. Because I do plan on reusing this handle. And most cheap machetes come off this way where they got screws built into the handle. So once again, thank you for 400 subs. And I will continue to do knife making and collecting and who knows what else. Hopefully I'll do another shooting video, but I haven't got any new guns to shoot. Oops, dropped my screwdriver. And basically what I plan to do is I've already drawn it on the blade. Is I plan to make a simple Bowie knife style. Like I said, a machete is an easy material anybody can get their hands on. All you have to do is go to a go to a Walmart and buy a cheap machete, or go to a flea market and buy an even cheaper machete. Like I said, it's the most common item you can get to make a knife with, and you don't feel bad about messing it up because machetes are generally a cheap material unless you buy a good one. Last one off. Put those screws in my pocket. Then take the handle off. All right. So there's the basic handle, and all. And since it's already got a black coating, I don't really need to do anything to it. All I'm gonna do is cut the tip and and shape the tip and put an edge on it with a grinder, and that's it. And all I'm just going to use is my basic angle grinder because this is how I started with just an angle grinder, nothing else. So that's how I started, so hope you enjoyed the video. got this piece if I ever want to make another knife out of it. Now all I gotta do is use my sanding disc and shape it up.
There we are. Got the basic profile. And all I have to do is just put an edge back on the top and should be good to go. And then I'll put the handle back on. And that's, all, that's just a simple modification anybody can do with just an angle grinder. That's all you have to have. Of course, you can use metal files and stuff like that to sharpen them with. Like that. And on top of that, I eat. Where's the case at? I left it in the house. But I also modified the sheet to where it can accept this. And since the blade's already got a black coating, you can barely tell that it had been modified. Like I said, just a simple Bowie knife style. Now let's put the handle back on. So if you want to try this out for yourself, I highly recommend it. It's something anybody can do with just an angle grinder. That goes to show all you have to do is just take a cheap machete that you can just buy from Walmart or buy it from a flea market. And like I said, that's how I started when I originally started knife making, was taking machetes that I buy dirt cheap and just chopping them up and making several knives out of them. Because it's an easy source material that's, a, if you really want to go cheap, it's an easy material to get a hold of. Screws back in. Or if I really want to go to it, I could probably create some saw teeth on the back of this machete, but I'm not going to do that. That's just more work, and I'm just keeping it simple because that's how it was when I first started. All right, last screw. All right, there we are. Just one simple modification. Of course, I'll clean the rust off the screws, but it's one simple modification anybody can do. It looks, it looks badass, and it is sharp, but it's a machete, so they probably, probably won't hold an edge, but it's cool. It's something anybody can do, and like I said, you can modify the sheath where you can make it accept the new blade. So I guess I hope you've enjoyed the video, and thank you all for my 400 subs, and as always, stay sharp.